you always get caught in your own little web that you weave when first we do start first to deceive practice to deceive say the rest oh what a oh what a tangled web we weave correct Mr. Speaker, and members of the Manitoba Legislature, welcome to the second session of the 39th Legislative Assembly of the Province of Manitoba. In addition, Manitoba has been working with the Canadian government and state governments in the U.S. to protect and enhance our access to key trade markets. In response to U.S. border security measures, Manitoba will begin offering an enhanced driver's license as an affordable and secure form of identification for travelers. The new license will be available in the fall of 2008. Manitoba is also taking a major role in the development of a mid-continent trade corridor, connecting our northern port of Churchill with trade markets throughout the central U.S. and Mexico. To advance the concept, an alliance has been built with business leaders and state and city governments spanning the entire length of the corridor. When fully developed, the trade route will incorporate an inland port in Winnipeg with pre-clearance for international shipping. Thank you. As uh, you three leaders meet here, there are a growing number of people in each of your countries who have expressed concern about the Security and Prosperity Partnership. This is addressed to all three of you. Can you say today that this is not a prelude to a North American Union, similar to a European Union? Uh, are there plans to build some kind of superhighway connecting all three countries? And do you believe all of these theories about a possible erosion of national identity stem from a lack of transparency from this partnership. Thank you for. Well, let me begin. I uh, and I guess I've read some things from my opposition in Canada. I'm not sure these are generally expressed concerns, but a couple of my opposition leaders have speculated on massive water diversions and uh, uh, super highways to the continent, maybe interplanetary. I'm not sure as well. Um, And I, I'm amused by some of the some of the speculation, uh, some of the old uh, you call them political scare tactics. If you've been in politics as long as I have, you get used to that kind of technique, where you lay out a conspiracy and then force people to try to prove it doesn't exist. And that's just the way some people operate. And uh, so I appreciate that question. I'm. I th I th I've, I'm amused by the difference between what actually takes place in the meetings and what some are trying to you know, say takes place. It's, a, it's quite comical, actually, when you realize the difference between reality and what some people are talking on TV about. Manitoba is also taking a major role in the development of a mid-continent trade corridor. Maybe interplanetary, I'm not sure. Connecting our northern port of Churchill with trade markets throughout the central U.S. and Mexico. The speculation. An alliance has been built with business leaders and state and city governments spanning the entire length of the corridor. Conspiracy. When fully developed, the trade route will incorporate an inland port in Winnipeg with pre-clearance for international shipping. Maybe interplanetary, I'm not sure. Conspiracy. Maybe interplanetary, I'm not sure. It's quite comical, actually. I've, I'm amused by the difference between what actually takes place in the meetings and what some are trying to you know, say takes place. It's, a, it's quite comical, actually. You can watch a person's eyes, and the pupil will start changing in size. You, you can watch their mouth when they're speaking. They get a little quiver, you know, 
it's little nuances that you have to learn to look for.